that? What's that in your pocket? It's a full bottle of Hero Tonic. It would have been smashed if you hadn't landed on your face. With this intact sample, I can try to reverse engineer the ingredients. That way, we can make an antidote and stop the evil from spreading. All right, let's take a sniff. to my smell -a base one of the ingredients is a rare weed found only in the forest. For the sake of the plaza and justice everywhere, I will get us that plant. Sure you're up for it, Sprout? Sounds pretty dangerous. Yeah, K.O. We still don't know who or what's behind the tonic. Well, I'm not scared. Justice will be made because I'm righteous and stuff like that. Okay, now I'm off. And don't try to stop me. Sir, I don't know if he's either very brave or very dumb. Honestly, Radicles, a little bit of both. Hey!
vacuum will make your quest easier. I designed it based on my latest hero tonic findings. In our secret labs we found that the liquid is in fact filled with microbots that attach themselves onto the brain of heroes. Yep, green stuff. Story checks out. When someone drinks the malicious liquid, the microbots latch onto the hero's brains and they turn evil. So with the help of Enid and Rad, we built this state-of-the-art suction device. Use it to suck the microbots out of everyone's head and turn them back into their normal, heroic selves. But remember, the brain vacuum is just a temporary solution. It leaves us heroes mighty weakened and unable to fight. We'll need the hero tonic antidote if we want to stand a chance at saving everyone for good. <laughs> <laughs> 